In this project, I want to explain how to create the octopus uh, hand like this. As you can see, we clone it, we model it, and uh, we modeling with a cloner. It's very important. From a two object, we clone it, then connect them, then go to the subdivision and use two deformer to achieve this octopus. Just uh, it's in technical. I want to show you the technical uh, of the this project technical comment let's begin okay let's begin to create i create a simple thing here uh, in this direction i make it a double my unit in millimeter this is an in centimeter you can convert it uh, i add a segment exactly at the middle no no in this not uh, through seeing that you have to go to display line no yeah exactly in this i want to uh, create two shape here make it editable and going to the surface i want to connect them in this way so i delete them <clears throat> and we want to clone them and after that delete them i select both of them right click uh inset don't forget to untick preserve group click and drag holding control and click once then click some click to add some edges there and nice edge here nice another click and drag go inside hold control a little and then go way inside nice and this is ready uh, we give it to we can give it after that to subdivision surface and this is our octopus hand nice so uh we need two of them this is small not the big we want to clone them and uh, blend them from the big circles to the small circle circles uh, like octopus hand so we copy that exactly in its position don't forget that hold alt to, uh, to hide this this is small version <clears throat> for a small version we are going to point mode in this direction going to select rectangle from here select all of these and make it smaller like this it's not important i don't want to exact modeling like this don't it's not important anymore select it again and make it a smaller like that just want to explain the talk technique not modeling that's nice uh and uh, yeah as you can see uh, we have two big and a small as you can see we are going to blend them with the cloner from the big to a small yeah and going to uh, select of course linear which direction which number in this direction the, exactly the uh, width of that if you select one of them go turn off the yeah, <clears throat> coordination manager as you can see this is our width you can uh, control c that then go to the cl cloner and control v enter as you can see they're exactly go at the same coordination and if you change the count as you can see it's because of iterate it's one big one small one big one small you can change the cloner to blend as you can see it's go to the big to the small nice <clears throat> you can increase the, the count and this is our octopus hand and after that because they are separate we need to what connect them go child of the connect and are connect now and after that you can subdivide them and nice this is our octopus hand <clears throat> and we need a uh, thinner uh, mm, 
uh, in uh, tip here at, at the end of the octopus hand. So we need a um, simple taper. Make it a bigger simple taper in this direction. I explained them before. You can go to our previous lesson. Okay, uh, this is a taper. As you can see, you can use a taper here. But first, we have to go to uh, length in the, uh, this direction. Uh, higher number. Oops. Yeah. This is good. And so we add a taper to the end. So how we can assign this? As you can see, we cannot bring them <clears throat> as a uh, child. You have to use a null and make them child. And as you can see, this is our octopus tip in this. So another deformer that we need, it is a um, exactly bent. For bent, I make it a child of that. And then the reset transforms exactly go to the that position. Then bring it out. And the hierarchy of priorities is <clears throat> very important. First, we need to execute the taper then execute the bend it's very important mm, the hierarchy so what is the uh yeah we can copy that and change the size of that to the exact size nice and it is it is in common and we can simply uh change the angle uh, and you can as you can see, change. Which angle do you want? Yeah, this angle. Nice. And here with the strings, you can change your octopus hand easily. And for better seeing that, you can turn them off and done. And interesting part, you can clone it like this. Of course, radial and nice here you can after that you can go to the blend and change up octopus and in the modeling you can close the tips and the bottom of the hands and you can turn off the nice hello my friends to continue these tutorials on youtube subscribe us like us and hit the bell icon and now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.